next up, I'm going to invite the person who applied this principle in his life for him to deliver the theme of today, this session. When the pandemic hit, the MLC sessions, which was face to face, was come to a stall. This person did not like completely bogged down. He immediately started doing a validation, doing a reflection of what is the challenge in front of him. And then he took a resolve, no matter what, if I need to do it, I need to deliver my duty. All I need to do is to refocus on what I'm going to do. He made it a wonderful design of a program called Peak Performer Workshop. And believe what? He has trained about 300 individuals with a same level of intensity how it could have been done through a live MLC course. Ladies and gentlemen, please put your hands together in welcoming the accredited trainer of MILT, Miltonian Daniel Jacob for his address. Beautiful. Welcome, Daniel. Super powerful. Right. Uh, thank you, Chandru, for your introduction. Well, friends, it's a new year still. We are just uh, 20 days into the new year. And according to some calendars, new year has just started. So now, whenever it's a new year, we always take a resolution. And shockingly, we fail in the resolution very shortly. Why? We should ask a question. I resolved with all my conviction, but why did I fail? The reason is you resolved out of an emotion. You resolved out of your intellect. And therefore, you couldn't stand or keep up to that resolution. So what, how do you keep up your resolution? How do you keep up your resolve? It is simple. You need to have clarity about what you're resolving. The moment you have clarity, you don't have to put an effort at all. Because when the goal is clear, when the clarity is there, I get the confidence. And this confidence comes because clarity. So therefore, don't widely take resolution, but have clarity in what you're doing. And that is going to give you strength. And resolve per se will not give you any strength. Well, in every MILT meeting, we take a resolution. And even now, we took a resolution. The resolution is, we do it with lots of conviction. But let's have clarity in that resolution so that we can truly live it in letter and spirit. We said we resolve to stand as one family, bound to each other with love and respect. So when we mean a family, we are not meaning a family of few individuals. We are meaning a family of humanity. So therefore, when we resolve to stand as one family, it is just not milk family, but as a humanity. In beautiful terminology, it is said, Vasudeva could become. So let's resolve to stand as that one universal family, bound to each other with love and respect. Well, love, as we are learned in milk, is not merely an emotion. It is an energy. And we respect to serve as an army, courageous and disciplined. Well, army men are courageous people. For what? To fight against all low tendencies and false values within and without us. So therefore, we are warriors to stand against our condition yeah. and to yeah. live our life. Yeah. It also says to live honestly a noble life of sacrifice and service. And that is what human beings are. Because we human beings alone can live a noble life of sacrifice and service. No other species can. It's only a human endowment. It also says producing more than what you consume and giving more than what we take. That is a trait of human beings. The ability for us to consume is pathetically low compared to our ability to contribute. Our ability to give is phenomenal than our ability to take. So let's have clarity of our human life that we can produce more, we can give more. And ultimately, we want the endorsement of the divine because we all know everything is being sustained because there is that energy, a powerful energy, a omnipotent energy, a omnipresent energy, a omniscient energy. So therefore, let's live life true to the resolution. Let's go beyond the barriers and identity of nationality, 
culture, religion, and let's connect to humanity. We need such people because only those people can make a big difference to the world. And finally, it says, we seek God's grace to keep us on the path of virtue, courage, and wisdom, to give us the ability to stand for our conviction. So therefore, let's not our resolution in milk be of formality, but let the resolution be with clarity. And then certainly a resolution or a resolve is worth taking. So we had a grand day yesterday with Reflect, and today we are resolving. Let's have a great time together, and let's really enjoy as much as we did yesterday. Thank you so much. Big round of applause, Thank you so much, Danny. Yes, we are all resolved to make a difference to this world because we came in. Thank you so much.